Well, hello and welcome to my DIY today. Today I am going to make crumble cookies. These are the ingredients you need. Let me get the other cup of sugar. Two cups of brown sugar, one and a half cups of white sugar, three eggs the chickens didn't eat, one pound of butter, one package of chocolate chips, one and a half teaspoons of salt, one and a half teaspoons of soda, two tablespoons of vanilla, six cups of flour, and optional is um, walnut. I, looked, I like to put them in there, and some people don't like them, so I'm going to do half and half. Uh, or, you know, it's up to you, whatever you want to put them in. Optional. So let's get those mixed up. Oops. Preheat your oven to 350, and you need an ice cream scoop. That's going to be how big we're going to make the cookies. And we're going to put in the eggs. Vanilla, two tablespoons, two brown sugars, a lot of sugar. That's probably why they taste so good. <laughs> One and a half cups of white sugar and a pound of butter. Softened. I'll have to scoop that out. Blend it up. Okay, one and a half teaspoons of salt and one and a half teaspoons of soda. And one package of chocolate chips. One package. Mix those in. Then six cups of flour. And since that goes all over the place, we need to turn that on. Mix that in there. Okay, let's take a look. Ah, perfect. There you go. And I added the walnuts because I like them. All right. Let's scoop them up and bake them. I put the cookie dough in the fridge for a while. And you just use your ice cream scoop. And that's the size you want. I know it's big, but we're doing cookie crumble size here. Okay, there's... I'm just going to do four for me and Papa O because if I cook them, I'll just eat them. And I'm just going to put this dough in the freezer. There, just get you a big scoop full. This ought to feed you. Okay, there's four cookies. Okay, we're going to cook those. And do not overcook them. Hey, it looks like they are done. They've been in there for 10 minutes. Set them on here to cool. Those look good. I'll wait till they cool off and then me and Papa O will give them a taste. And those are huge cookies, but they're very delicious. And so usually I make just little ones, but then you think you have to eat four of them because that wasn't enough. And Papa O's been eating the cookies. He says they are very good. Are they oh. the best cookies you've ever tasted in your entire life? That's what the recipe says. <laughs> Let me see, they're still warm. Well, it's because the cookie itself tastes good. It's not just the chocolate. Good. Now I'm big like this. Mm -mm -mm, very good. Okay, the rest of the cookies I just put on here. And I'm going to freeze them. And then when I want to cook them, seriously, I will get them out. Of the best cookies I've ever tasted. Okay. That's what Julianne said. She says they're the best cookies you'll ever taste. Oh, and that's the name of them, too. But, well, they're just actually... Well, let's call them that. <laughs> and um, see, if I cooked all these up, we'd probably eat them. So I'm not going to cook them. I'm just going to freeze them like this. Put them in the freezer, and then I will bag them after they freeze. <laughs> they, no, some people like to eat raw dough, raw cookie well, dough. <laughs> no, but once it tastes like this, you won't go back. That's to the true. Raw. You won't go to the raw. So there you have it. <laughs> and Papa O wants to know if dinner's ready yet. <laughs> Okay, you put saran wrap over these cookies, put them in the freezer, and then once they freeze, then I can put them into a bag. These are all done being frozen overnight. I just need to bag them and then put them back in the freezer so we can eat them for later. Gator. Right, make sure you put on here what they are, how, and I put on there how long to bake them and the date. Now just keep them in the freezer. Chocolate chip cookies anytime you want. And when the grandkids come back, I am ready. Well, thanks for liking, commenting, and subscribing. And remember, uh, my DIYs come on every Friday at 2. And uh, enjoy the best chocolate chip cookies ever. Thank you and good night.